CompTIA A Plus Core 2, 220-1102, Practice Exam. Questions 191 through 195. This video is part of our practice exam video series and is filled with questions that closely resemble the real exam. So are you prepared to test your knowledge? Great, let's begin. Question 191. While browsing the internet, an individual encounters a message that states, your connection is not private. What is the most likely reason for this warning? The answer is, A. Invalid certificate. This warning typically indicates a problem with the website's security certificate, suggesting it is either expired, not issued by a trusted authority, or not configured correctly. Secure websites use security certificates to encrypt the connection between the user and the server, ensuring data privacy and integrity. If the browser detects any issues with this certificate, it will alert the user to prevent potential security risks. Question 192. A technician knows they will be 15 minutes late for a scheduled appointment. Given the need for proper communication and professionalism, what should the technician do? The answer is, C. Contact the customer to inform them of the delay. When a technician knows they will be 15 minutes late for a scheduled appointment, contacting the customer to inform them of the delay is the correct action to take. This approach demonstrates respect for the customer's time and helps manage their expectations. Additionally, informing the customer about the delay allows them to make any necessary adjustments to their schedule, reducing potential frustration and inconvenience. Question 193. Which of the following internet options tabs inside control panel would be most appropriate for the technician to set up a proxy server? The answer is, D. Connections. The connections tab in the internet options inside the control panel is the most appropriate for setting up a proxy server because it allows the technician to configure how the computer connects to the internet. This tab includes the LAN settings button, which is where proxy server settings can be specified. By selecting LAN settings, the technician can enter the proxy server address and port, enabling the workstations to route internet traffic through the proxy server. Question 194. Which of the following would best protect data if a mobile device is misplaced? The answer is C. Full device encryption. Full device encryption ensures that all data stored on the device is converted into an unreadable format. Without the correct decryption key, unauthorized users cannot access the data. This means that even if the device falls into the wrong hands, the information remains secure and inaccessible, thereby preventing data breaches and protecting sensitive information. Question 195. A company is developing software for a smart home device and needs to choose an operating system that is widely supported and commonly used in the industry for embedded systems. Which of the following operating systems is most commonly used in embedded systems? The answer is, D. Linux. The Linux operating system is widely used in embedded systems due to its open-source nature, flexibility, and extensive community support. It allows developers to customize the system to fit specific hardware requirements and resource constraints typical of embedded environments. So, did any of these questions give you a tough time? Don't worry if they did, it's all part of the learning process. Luckily, Certification Synergy has a wealth of free video content at your disposal. To stay connected with our latest IT learning resources, just give a quick click on the subscribe button. This simple action ensures you're always updated about our newest video releases. Thank you for watching. Subscribe for more great content.